Hey guys, it's John from Dragonfly here. So today I'm gonna show you a fix for a super, super frustrating problem. If you can see down here, we get the, uh, you know, the little yellow exclamation of death telling us we have no internet access, even though the internet on this system works fine, as you can see um, here. Well, whatever, I'm not even gonna d demonstrate it. Let me just show you the fix. I'll show you all the things that I did to fix this that I wasted the last two weeks on. And uh, now let me show you what the fix is. First, you go to Device Manager. Well, the first thing you need to do, this is probably uh, a result of having an Intel network card on your system. So uh, what you need to do is either go to your motherboard manufacturer's website and download their version of the driver, or go to downloadcenter.intel.com, download the tool, it'll scan your computer, find the, uh, find the network card, and it'll uh, install the right drivers for you because you can't do this unless you have these drivers. So here's what you're gonna do. Find the find the network card that you're actually using. If it's the wireless, you probably only have one. I have a few network cards on this system, so I know that this is the right one. Um, if you're using a wired connection and you want to check, uh, you know, if it's if the, if the link status is green, then you know you're using the right one if you have multiple connections like I do. So here's the fix. You're gonna go to advanced and then down to offloading options, and then go to properties, the IP4 checksum offload. You can see that it's set to RX and TX enabled. You're gonna disable that, okay? Now watch, I'm gonna hit okay, and then you're gonna see down here in the corner, you're gonna see I'm gonna lose my network connection, and when it comes up, instead of having that yellow exclamation point, it's going to uh, have, uh, it's gonna be fixed, watch. So hit okay, hit okay, now let's watch down here. We just lost internet connection. And give it about 15 seconds. Okay, we're gonna come back. That's gonna disappear, trust me. You're better. There we go. So it took about 20 seconds there. I know everyone is probably thinking that I was uh, gonna edit that out, but I left it in so that you can see it does take a little while. It takes about 20 seconds, you gotta be patient, and then it goes away. So now if we hover over it, it's telling me that I have internet connection. So that's the fix. Now I've had this problem on so many different systems and I've seen so many different fixes for it. Again, I'll put up my list of all the things I tried before I found this. Uh, this this fix for it and this this permanently fixed it. So I actually uh, re-enabled that setting uh, yesterday uh, and it took a little while f for that problem to happen again uh, and then uh, now it's 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 fixed again now that we made this uh, connection. So why that matters is that your internet still works fine. So it's no big deal. You can still browse the internet. But the problem is it disconnects Adobe uh, Creative Cloud and that'll tell you that you have no internet connection. Uh, it disconnects Office 365. So again, that'll tell you that you have no in internet connection and you, you can't sign into your account. It limits a bunch of the features. Uh, and then anything else that needs like a persistent connection to the internet will be broken when you have that, uh, that yellow exclamation part. There's a few other things that have been broken that uh, I have, um, uh, that you, you know, like I didn't take a mental note of, but I can tell you like it's just, what you're gonna see is that you go through your, your day, you're gonna see more and more stuff that doesn't work. So uh, it's super frustrating. I spent two effing weeks trying to figure out what the fix is and doing all these different things. So I made this video, I hope people see it. This is one of those videos, even though I, I make a lot of videos and some of them are just kind of, you know, shit or whatever. This is one that I'm really hoping people find so that you know, share it with people so that they can uh, they can get this this issue fixed because it's so frustrating and it can take so much time. Uh, I think that this will fix this on any system that's using an Intel network card that's having this problem where you've already done all the traditional fixes and it didn't work. Thanks again for watching. Check out my other videos and we'll talk to you soon.